An emotional week for Michaela LeBlanc. I cried, girl, yeah, I was crying for hours. Her hands full with her little son Wyatt, she's now struggling to find a brand new wedding venue because hers was sold. I was so sad. I just, I had it all planned out, so it was hard. Michaela's wedding was set for next May at the Tewksbury Country Club. Not only is she searching for a new venue, she may also have to find new vendors. God forbid that some other venue doesn't have the exact date. I have to make sure that all of my other venues or vendors have that date. And if they don't, I lose a photographer, I lose a makeup artist, I lose my DJ. The club's owner says this happened unexpectedly. An opportunity came along out of nowhere. This wasn't even a conversation three weeks ago. He says weddings for this year will go on, but 35 weddings for 2023 are off. He says they're trying to make it right. We funded everybody's uh, uh, event. And we also gave them some compensation for the inconvenience here. The owner also offering to help couples find new venues and vendors if need be. Uh, we're doing everything in our power to make their day still special. Michaela says her vendors do fit her budget. I don't have the money for that. I'm already paying 25000 to get the club. So it's going to be difficult. It's going to be tough. I'm not sure what we're going to do. Now, on its website, Treehouse Brewing says we will evolve the space into an expansive and inviting beer hall and retail store and continue to operate the golf course and various amenities with the full strength of our crew behind it. Michaela says she is anticipating getting her deposit back. The last weddings will be held here at the end of this year.